Before the break, I interviewed Matt from Platinum Hydroponics and the girls were given the task of setting up one of his hydroponic dripper systems. Okay, so showing you the whole process would take up the entire episode, so we've speeded it up. Hopefully, this gives you an idea of what's involved in the setup of this system. Okay, so almost there now, as you can see, again, run through the system. Pump's gonna pump it up, down the irrigation, into the lining, and each dripper then will spike into the growing medium, whichever one we decide to use. And that basically will continuously then drip feed, drip feed, drip feed. You can put that on the timer if you wanted, if you wanted to drip at particular times in the day. Um, and also you could set it to a pressure that was sort of dripping continuously, little and often, but most people have them through a the timer. Final piece on this, which is quite unique of the system, is this is your nice little viewing panel that I explained to you before, so you can still get to your pump, you can see what's happening, you can actually still get to the dial if you thought that the flow rate on the water was um, too strong or too, too slow, um, basically. And you can also, there's a gradient in here, so when you can see, you can see what level your tank is in literage. And what you really don't want doing, you don't want any of the lighting hitting the nutrient solution water because that can cause problems to the nutrient. Okay. So what you basically do, pop your little cover on, job done. Job's a good one. And what we could also do then, the final sort of, you know, where you need to be in the system, the final piece really is you decide which growing medium you want and basically you'd fill the pot up, okay. get it to the desired level. If it's clear pebbles, you might have to treat them to get them pH stable. Instance to that. And how far up are we going to be filling these pots? Uh, again, that, that varies depending on which plant you're growing. Um, for today, basically, if, you, if you, you're not going to be too careful if you're about an inch away, so sort of from the top. And this particular one with the drainage piece that we put in earlier on, this will become quite key because this is quite it's quite a thin growing medium. Like I said, you can use clay pebbles, cocoa or indeed the stone. Um, basically, what you do then, you fill each individual pot. And this particular, like I said, in these kind of dripper systems really is you would have an established little plant okay. or a little cutting basically and that could sit in a rockwool cube sort of plate it into situ and then basically now then that's where the spike would come in and you would spike it into the nutrient into the grow media as easy as that easy as so there you have it setting up the platinum 12 pot hydro pro system took Matt about 19 minutes However, he did stop to talk and explain what he was doing at several points throughout the process. Matt did comment that the studio was cold that day. This made connecting the irrigation pipe very difficult and it would certainly affect the girls' setup time. Let's see how they got on setting up their platinum systems in the presenter challenge. <laughs> 